The celebrant, Chief Loki Nusaka Igbenedion, family and friends, led by his father, the patriarch of the House of Igbenedion and A. Summer of Benin, saw Chief Dr. Gabriel Osawa Igbenedion dancing to the altar to offer thanks to God for 60 years of God's faithfulness. In a sermon titled, If Not for God, Reverend Olu Abionomo from Central Baptist Church Benin said Chief Loki Igbenedion is blessed by God, having clocked 60 years full of achievement and fruitfulness. Reverend Abinomo said Chief Loki Nosaka Igbenedion still has so much to do for Nigeria and humanity. And we know that even God, none of us sitting here today will be here today for any reason. Certainly, even God, those privileges in life will not be yours. God bestowed upon you greatness and outstanding privileges in life. See your education, your working experience, of governance at different levels. Your choice and elections were God led. I go back to think about the recent one. Not many young persons of your age were given such opportunities, especially when you know you are not a military officer. The first Bible reading was taken by the celebrant's son, Mr. Nosa Ibnedion. In a special tribute, the celebrant's father and a summer of Benin, Sir Chief Dr. Gabriel Usawa Ibnedion, recalled the joy that greeted the birth of his son, Chief Loki Nosaka Ibnedion, on May 13, 1957, and said he was grateful to God for the life of his son. To see your own son, clock 60 years, uh, in the good head. Today is my joy. Because I and my father did not witness my 60 years of age. Father and my mother. So God has sustained me. So I'm grateful, grateful for everybody that has. Look at the greatness of people. Look at the people that have answered you. We can be the Lord disciples. And the God that has blessed all of you. <laughs> The celebrant's daughter, Osasu Ibnedion, described her father as one who has been there for the family, while some dignitaries, including Senator Ben Obi, Chief James Ibori, and former Chief of Staff to President Goodluck Jonathan, who was also Deputy Governor to the celebrant, Chief Mike Ugadume, took turns to eulogize Chief Loki Ibnedion. I'm very happy uh, to celebrate the life of my dear father, Chief Loki Nusahari Ibnedion, uh, marking sister. 60 years of age is truly by the grace of God and uh, we are all so proud of you and all your accomplishments thus far. Well, we are here to celebrate the life of a gentleman and uh, a great man for that matter. A man who has a very, very large heart. I believe I've been working very closely with him for eight full years in adulthood. I know him deeper than uh, most people may be religious, but I really know him. Uh, he is uh, a very compassionate person. A man I used to say has great confidence in himself. Because he's a man who reposes a lot of confidence in his followers. So I see him and I saw him, I know him as a great leader, an entrepreneur, a good politician. Very few children stand in front of their parents and listen to the father say, I am proud of this son. In the first of God himself, this is my son. Listen to me. We are proud of him. You laid the foundation stone for democracy in this country and you are a cornerstone of that foundation. Don't forget that. I thank God for your life. As I said in my tribute, I am resisting the temptation to be private and personal. But all I know of you is that you are a good man. Like everyone has said, there's happy any time one wants to you for cancer, for health, that you do not rise to the Chief Loki Nosaka Ibnedion, who described himself as the luckiest person on earth, said he is grateful to God for the grace to celebrate 60 years, adding that at 60, he still has his father with him, hale and hearty. But first and foremost, I'm 
very much good to God. Because without him, nothing is possible. I have not recognized the Almighty. The reason I say I'm the luckiest person here today is because right before your very eyes, my father stood up without any more to stick, without any other that this is more happier than me. <laughs> My joy knows no bound. Because even though I have children and grandchildren, I actually feel like a baby too. <laughs> My cousin Anna is always teasing me. Anytime I go to Benin, before I get to Benin, lunch is ready at my dad's house. Himself and his wife will make sure I eat some just eat. In the evening, I go to my mother's house to go and eat to go and the stash. <laughs> so this is why I say that I'm a very, very lucky man. Men Missionary of New Estate Baptist Church Abuja and Central Baptist Church Benin presented birthday cards and gifts to the celebrant. The ceremony later shifted to the celebrant's residence for a lavish reception. Reporting.